we try to do as much local as we can and found out the best booths were made in our own state and really only a couple hours away. So, you know, knowing that they'd be close, that we would give them the shot and we did and we couldn't be happier. And then to find out about their tech center up there and to be able to go and use that and and the quality of people they have up there. You know, everybody assumes because you build these cars, you, you're the best or you're good at what you do, but there's always somebody better. And trust me, there, there's better people up there that have taught us a lot, um, showed us new products, showed us the Revo system. There's one thing about somebody coming in and demoing it in your own shop, but you're always a little skeptical, you know, but when you can go use it and using different products um, and using systems that they have up there, it really opened our eyes and and uh, it's, it's fun too. You wish our shop was up there because we'd really have a nice shop then. <laughs> you call up there with any issues at all and there's somebody on the phone and, and you always get, you know, the answer you're looking for and um, right down to the people that are there, they're all awesome midwestern honest people so um it's a it's a great company and uh um, it shows obviously if if you buy something from gfs uh they're going to be there for you when we got our new gfs booth it was you know it was a godsend because we didn't have all the issues that we had with with uh our other booth. I mean, um, it was actually clean for once. Uh, it saves us so much time, and it was uh, it was one of the best purchases we've ever made. To be able to cure something in no time and get another car in, I mean, it's it's been awesome. And we do a lot of carbon fiber work, so with the carbon fiber to cure things quick and to kick things, and with collision, you need to get it in and out, but also with Building these cars, there's a lot of times that Jim will say, paint this blue, and you'll paint it. And he's like, oh, I don't like it. Paint it red. or you know. So you're always changing things, and usually it's like he says, it's last minute, so we need to get things done. And being able to have that ability to do the painting in-house um, is huge. And change your mind. You spent all the time and all of the money and, and to, to build these cars and the first thing anybody looks at is the finish of these cars. So it's very important that they're right and you have to have the right tools to make them right. And today guys are so good. I mean, the level of cars are so great. Um, the, the guys that know cars judge you more than just by the paint, but the amateur really they still want to look down the side of the car and judge you by that only instead of all the others. So paint's still the most important part of a build. For me, it's, 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 it's awesome. It, it gives you the ability to speed things up. And I would have to say for him, it's the same thing. I mean, it's, a, it's an awesome tool. I don't know what we did without it. Yeah, that handheld out of, out of all of them gets used by far the most, and everybody in the shops use it, not just in the paint shop, but for the guys that are tearing apart an old hood that are bonded together with different type of glues, they take that Revo light, warm it up. It doesn't warp the panel, but yet it makes them be able to remove bonding materials between them to taking off decals to I've used it to take gaskets off of things I mean I've used it for a bunch of different things but it's you know it's it's a uh, I grab that instead of my heat gun most of the time it's doing pretty well you know it get used it get used every day and several times a day and uh, really with with no issues at all um, you know, filter changes are relatively easy in it. Um, it's just it's just been a great booth for us. There's no comparison. I mean, an old single walled booth because we were cheap and and uh, just looking for a place to spray and you know that was a huge mistake. I can't imagine how much that cost us not 
just stepping up and buying a good booth right out of the chute. But sometimes, you know, you just can't afford it. But when you start to get a little older and you realize what, how your dollars are spent and spending a little more to get a lot more, um, it just comes with age, I think, and having the ability. We got to, that. Yeah. <laughs>